Now we're talking with Marge and Michael. Marge, why are you here? Well, I'm here because I went to the march the other day with all the other 25 plus thousand. Mm -hmm. And we are very perturbed it's because it's blasphemous in the sense that the people seeing it are going to be deceived into thinking that Jesus was more human than divine. I mean, that's obvious in the picture. And the fact that it's a fantasy doesn't go over at all because they said he had, in the picture, this somebody I was talking to you right now I just saw it, and they said that uh, Jesus came uh, came down and got Mary uh, Magdalene pregnant, and then he got went on with Mary and Martha and got, had children by them. Well, now, naturally, there's nothing in the Bible about that, but, but, but to see that means that the director and the people behind it were trying to be uh, uh, what you might call, uh, trying to destroy the faith of the most of the people in the United States. The country was founded on a, on a belief in God, and the, all the schools originally were Christian in the beginning. Even the universities, Yale and, uh, and all those ones in the East were Christian. Do you think that it would destroy the faith of people uh, who even weren't Christians? Uh, I, we were discussing that, another fellow who thought up here. He said, uh, I'm a backslider, but he said it, it didn't hurt me because I felt quite defensive doing parts of it. But he said, I don't know how it's going to affect younger people. And I also would say that if these people have never been inside of a church, it might be good for them. What movie do you think they, these people should be seeing? Not just a movie today, but just any movie. Well, if you could, if you could replace this movie with one of your own well, choosing, well, what I would had, it be? Last night I saw it on TBN. They had the the, uh, the Jesus movie, which uh, Campus Crusade did several years ago, mm -hmm. and it's lovely and it's authentic and it's marvelous and it it, it really brings your uh, insides and your heart and your soul. So it's to an affirming, religiously that affirming movie. That is the way to go. <laughs> what about the director, Martin Scorsese? Well, He's I, a Catholic. I, People yes, have been accusing him. I've talked to uh, Catholics that say he is, he, he went to high school, Catholic high school. He might have entered the priesthood, but he got into Darwin. He admits that it was in the new newspaper. I've been reading up yeah. on him. And when you get into Darwin with evolution, my, you see, uh, my son went to college, and, he, and in, I noticed that philosophy, his face started to wander around too. But you see, he got to thinking, well, maybe we're gonna come back as somebody else, you know, all that, and he got confused. And since then, he's never, ever really been a Catholic. There isn't a Catholic that will tell you he's a Catholic. The point is he went to Catholic high school. Mm -hmm. And then the, uh, the writer, I mean, the writer of the book was Greek Orthodox, you know, and they kicked him out of the church. And when he died, this has been in the paper recently, they wouldn't let him be buried in Greece. Yeah. That's true. Yeah. So uh, I uh, I couldn't take it because uh, I wouldn't see it. But there are Christians that see it just so that you can say you saw it. So you you aren't planning on seeing oh, it? Oh, never. No, I think that it's demonic. Do you feel that you're strong I, enough in your faith I where it know, wouldn't yes, sway you? I know about demons, and uh, you you can cast them out, but they're in there. They're in there, honestly. And they haven't made a decision whether to pull the picture. They're going to make it next week. Yeah. They, oh, make the decision not, whether to yeah, not, not to release it. Yeah, they're not talking about uh, opening it up. It was in today's paper that the decision will be next week because they're going to find out how the business is uh, today, tomorrow, and a few more days. Do you think that the, the 25,000 people that turned out... It was more uh, enough, by the way, but that's the way they oh, go. Oh, okay. Well, uh, oh, do you fun. think that I they... Do you think, though, that they uh, gave this picture more publicity, that people really wouldn't have bothered no, to see it no, unless they had seen it on the news no, so much? Between you and me, I think God knows what he's doing. He's opening it to these people, as you say, that are coming in now who, who are expecting to mock and get, you know, laugh about it, but they're being touched, some of them. Now, I'm not saying they're being touched to make a decision for God, but they're being open enough to think. And we're, we've been passing out tracks and all kinds of stuff in the line yesterday. It was very busy yesterday. Mm -hmm. And they took them. And I talked to a lot of young men, and they were open, and they listened, and they, they said, I told them their mother was praying for them. They said, how did you know? <laughs> so do you think that this movie attracts people that maybe need uh, to be saved, I, need, to, uh, need to accept the Christ? And I made today, I didn't make that decision yesterday, but today I kind of think that God is working it out for a while. He's, he's waiting to see where everybody stands on it. Mm -hmm. And... Uh, letting people opening it up the name of jesus is being talked about they say but that's what people yeah. the people if you're being talked about you're important you know like kind of even the director said that just seeing the movie would uh, at least get you to re-examine or or a lot of these people have never been in a, in, in the church you know what about last week uh, in south africa there was a movie called cry freedom 
Well, uh, an anti, it's an anti-apartheid movie, and they were going to open it in South Africa. After the very first yeah. showing, they pulled it because uh, the government thought it would be well, unhealthy, unwise. It really was, uh, don't forget now about South Africa. There are a, an awful lot of whites down there, and they're very Christian, a lot of them. Uh, we have contact with their churches, and they have crusades down there. But, and also the blacks have good jobs down there, some of them. And th that's the friction. There's a lot of friction going on. The other blacks uh, Do you think are being stirred up by some forces, and I won't mention names. But you see, the ones that have the jobs and the policemen, they're murdering them off. The blacks are murdering the blacks down there. They're not murdering the whites. Do you think apartheid is a is a Christian no, I don't, I don't, no, no, philosophy? No, 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 and they don't either. But you can't do it overnight. You can't pull out all these businesses and expect the, the country to prosper. The blacks are going to be out of work, some of them. Mm -hmm. And a lot of them, and they don't want to be out of work. They have their little families and everything, and then some of them come in from another country. they got to go back with their money and support their kids and everything. They're rushing it, and we, nobody believes in apartheid, nobody. But why are they rushing it? Is it a communist thing? You I won't we'll say find a out. word, you won't no. say a word, but I will. Would you have preferred that our government pull this movie like the South African government pulled no, Cry Freedom? the government will not pull this movie, no. But would you prefer that they did? No, no, no. I think that, uh, that, that, that the people who are involved, if they're getting their money back and, and they're smart, they will pull it. What does your sign you know, say? You know what they said today? Uh, did you, you Thumbs down, temptation is sick. No, that's the answer. But I didn't make the sign. Somebody else. So it's like a Roger Ebert, Gene Siskel, yeah. thumbs down. But what, what were you saying then? You said something. You were about to say something. Yeah, but you, you said something. What else? The one thing, the one thing that you want said here. Yeah, what should um, it be? What is it? Well, I don't know. What would I say? <laughs> Whatever you, your final thought, your opinion. Well, the final thought is that today I feel a little bit better than I did. We were very disturbed on uh, Thursday when we went up to the uh, thing, but we just whooped it up, and we were going to uh, uh, boycott MCA products. Which and are what? Oh, we got a long list. You might not know it, but Sears is involved in it, and uh, and uh, uh, that bank um, that has the uh, you know the horses pulling it. Um, Wells Fargo. Yeah, Wells Fargo's got a big, a big uh, lot of stock in it. And uh, a lot of them, a lot of companies that that every day that you would use, and they're going to be given out to any of the Christians that were there Thursday. If they call in, they'll give them out. They got a long list, mm -hmm. and they would only for a year they would boycott them, because they didn't. Wasserman didn't answer us back, as if to say, "I'm sorry that you're feeling badly." Instead, he was me mean and nasty and went right ahead, and and, and, he, and he bypassed everybody that we we feel that are important to us and to the, the, the Christian uh, faith. And uh, they, they keep on saying the right wing Christians, but believe me, every denomination, every color was there Thursday. Every, uh, every type of person you ever heard of was there. And little babies in prams, up to, several hundred of them in prams. Well, they weren't really oh, there by choice, though, were they? And little bits of things. And their mothers and fathers took the day off to go. It was marvelous how many thousands of them took the day off and, and went without pay to go Thursday to the march and the conference. Uh, the uh, thing. Well, Do you feel like that in order for you to be free to express your opinion that uh, Universal, MCA, should be free to uh, allow an artist like well, Martin Scorsese see, to express his in the form of this movie? With the, I was in the show business for years. What were you? Yeah, dancer. And yeah. Billy Rose shows you know, how far back that goes <laughs> in New York. Uh, but the point that I'm bringing out is that, um, sure, they can do it because I myself know that they, they want to make the money. Everybody has to work, and if that's the talent, that was my talent. See, and I was a gymnast, taught gymnastics for about 16 years after I retired from dancing. Mm -hmm at different schools in the uh, Los Angeles Recreation Department. And, uh, but the point I'm bringing out is they can do it, but it's not that at all. It's our, we believe that, that Jesus is God. You, know, you have to see it this, what we believe. We believe that God came down in, in the flesh as a baby to reconcile man with God because they were bad and evil and the bad and evil again. So he may have to come again, but they, this time it's going to be what we call the great catching up, the rapture, and then the seven years tribulation with all, all kinds of plagues and everything. What do you think God has planned for the people that uh, brought this film to the screen? For the director, for no, the people no, at Universal? No, no, he has planned for them at all. We would like to see them all repent and, and 
find the way and, and be sorry and just say, gee, I was wrong. I, I'm, I hope you aren't going to hold it against us. Then we would drop all our thing against uh, MCA. We'd drop everything. We, I mean, why would we? we Christians forgive. Right. They forgive. If, if the person will say, gee, I, 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 I was wrong. I'm sorry. Now, I understand, and I may be wrong, uh, Wasserman's son, who's a Jew, is a Christian. I, I didn't know that. Now, you see, I haven't verified except people tell me this. You see, I, they tell me this. You see, that might make a point with God. He might be saying maybe the son is going to reach the father. You can't tell what's going to happen. But uh, anyway, we're not mad. We're not feisty. Uh, there might be some noise here, but they're not feisty. We just stick to what we believe, and we're not going to compromise that Christ was hum human with uh, temptation. He did not give in to it. He knew his... Well, even, even in the movie, he doesn't really give into yeah, it, does he? his mission on earth is miscarry. His mission was solely to come to reconcile man with God and, and do the healings and everything and, and, and then return to heaven. He's, on, he's sitting now at the right-hand side of God. In the Bible, it talks about that. He's sitting there, but, but he is, as we know, the, the Trinity. God, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. Yeah. See, now the Holy Spirit we have in us. If you're a Christian, you got that Holy Spirit in you. And you can cast out demons or anything. You see, the, uh, this is demonic. I know it. That's why. I, there are Christians that have seen it. But I don't approve of that. I think that why would they want to see something they don't approve of or they don't have any use for? Uh, it's, it, it could be demonic. Curiosity is a human frailty human weakness. Yeah, that's right. But the war is on. The religious war is on, and, and we love it. We're getting, no, we're getting some publicity, and you're giving it to us, too. And, and the Christians need it. They've been, they've been uh, bashed around a little bit in the With last With the Jim and Tammy years. Baker and Jimmy yeah, Swaggart. Yeah, some and of those others. Who, how do you feel about that? only one or two. I mean, hmm. are you going to judge everybody from, oh, they made an error, uh, you would say immoral error. And we Christians are forgiven them. We have forgiven them, but the public hasn't. You see, they like to play this up and keep it going. No, everybody's got these little skeletons in their closet, and uh, they might come out someday, you know. You can't hide them forever. Yeah. And they did go off. They did go off the track. Uh, and we were very brokenhearted about it all, because I used to watch PTL. You did? You watched and, the PTL? And, and Tammy and, and, and the Jim were called of God. They were. And besides that, they have great talent. Great talent, great talent. And did you used to support them, send them money? Well, I, I never, luckily I never had the money to send. If I suppose I might have, if I did. But you know, uh, I always just had enough to go around, maybe five or ten dollars. But that's not supporting them. Mm. No. Who do you watch now? Well, I, I watch TBN, Trinity Broadcasting Channel 40. They have 110 stations that they that they own right now. You know, all around the, every place, and they're marvelous. I'm very happy with them. So Jerry Falwell doesn't really uh, no, do Jerry anything for Falwell's you. No, Jerry in the East, and uh, you see, we don't, we're not in touch with him too much at all. No, we're not. Uh, our group is out in the West here. We're we're uh, Californians, and a, and of course now the station reaches every city right now, almost. But uh, no, we like all Christians. I mean, we're not going to get uh, telling you anything that's against any of them. We don't do that. We don't do that. Well, what about people who claim that this is uh, this hurts Christian Jewish relations? No, that's not true. I'm sorry that Heimer Heimer has apologized a dozen times. It's been in the paper every day. He did mean that, although he did overdo it. He did. He may repent now and be a little sorry. But I will say that he's that flamboyant type. You know, he's got he's going out in front. This is it. That's it. But the average Christian isn't that way at all. But but the thing uh, that he he did he said it. Yes, you're right. But he did not mean that. He meant that we can't afford to have any problem with with the, the Jews in Israel because we believe that Jesus is the Jew. You know that he is coming back to the New Jerusalem in Jerusalem, not over here somewhere, and that the Jews will all be eventually converted because he is their Messiah, and they may not believe it. But he is their Messiah. Well, good luck to you. Thank you. Thank you for talking to us. Thank you.